speaking to Good Morning Britain, Meghan Markle's estranged half-sister Samantha Markle gave an update on their father's ailing health after he was hospitalized last week. She also confirmed that Meghan has not made any attempt to reach out to the family, in particular to her father, Thomas Markle, an act which she calls ridiculous. Ms. Markle said, his phone number has never changed, his address has never changed, and even though he can't speak, his language comprehension is perfect. She could text him, she could contact him and he can text back. Shush has not reached out. She added, if you want to speak to your father just do it. Ms. Markle continued, the idea that it would be justified to disown one's father because he was photographed, or that he, or that that was opportunist is crazy. She added, particularly on, the grounds that the people who are saying that, particularly my sister and Harry, have been quite public and photographed, you know, everywhere, whether it's Texas or on the grave of fallen war heroes, I don't want to get into what is considered opportunistic photography but my father pales by comparison. Ms. Markle concluded, I know what he was doing was admirable and he never should have been disowned and treated that way. Meghan Markle's estranged father Thomas Markle was admitted to hospital following a stroke in the early hours last Tuesday. Speaking previously on Good Morning Britain, royal biographer Tom Bauer confirmed that the estranged father and Meghan haven't been in contact since just before the wedding, in 2018. Thomas did not attend Meghan and Harry's royal wedding in 2018. Speaking on GB News last week, royal expert Ray Padel Manku spoke of how Meghan previously doted on her father and also credited him with bringing her up. Speaking on Good Morning Britain, Samatha revealed that Thomas is doing better but admitted he has a long road to recovery ahead of him. She said, I think he feels blessed to be alive and HES doing well, HES really doing well. Samantha also revealed that it could take six months to a year realistically for her father to learn to speak again. Last month, the 77-year-old said that he was planning to fly to the UK in June to join in celebrations for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. During his visit, he was hoping to reunite with his daughter and meet his grandchildren, Archie and Lilibet, for the first time.